Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha Geary and today we are going to do a vlog. What was that? I'm back in my apartment and I'm gonna start cooking. So today I'm gonna make eggs. So first things first, you gotta heat up the pan, get it nice and hot. Do not test the pan yourself to see if it's hot, like don't touch the bottom. I did that once and I burned myself. So just feel it up here and if it feels warm to you, then you're good. So now we're gonna get some eggs. I personally get two eggs and I cook them over medium. That's a term I learned while I was working for a chef at a student dining hall. Let's add some bacon because why not? So, it feels warm-ish. Excuse the mess, but it feels about right. It's on medium. So I'm gonna get my pan, pan, and spray the pan. I don't know why I'm doing a tutorial on cooking eggs. Like you guys don't know how to cook eggs, but you know, why not? So once we have it nice and panned up, we're gonna crack the eggs against the pan as so. If you get some shells in there, don't worry about it. It'll just be a little extra crunchy. And then again on the side. That was really nice. Okay. So then we're gonna throw away the eggshells. And great, we're off to a great start, ladies and gents. Next, we're gonna grab somebody else's pepper and pepper our eggs. That was a lot of pepper. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna roll with it. I'm gonna get some seasoning. I use Lori seasoned salt, but you can use any salt. Again, if you don't season your eggs, what's wrong with you? Now that these eggs look good and fresh, we're going to flip them like so. You probably could not see that. Now that you have a clear view of the eggs, as you can see, this one is flipped over and this one is not. So I'm just gonna grab it and see if I can flip this baby over. Probably not, you know, sometimes just, okay. Sometimes you just gotta grab it. They're kind of hard to deal with, like me. You know, it's not the prettiest, or the most symmetrical, but we get the job done. And that's what I tell myself every day when I look at myself in the morning. You see how messy that is? It doesn't need to be that messy, but I'm really bad at cooking. Cool, so while those cook, we'll go to intermission. 2,000 years later. As you can see, it should be a little squishy in the middle. That's easy, medium. Some terminology I'm teaching you guys. You're welcome. So once this is cooked, we're gonna start on our bacon. You can cook your bacon and eggs on the same skillet, but that's unless you want bacon grease on your eggs. And today I wasn't feeling greasy, so I am just going to open this up and be right back. Now we need to repan them and spray it all over. So you'll see that it's going to start looking like greasy little bumps on it and I don't know how to fix that but I figured it's just part of the process. It's going to look gross because it's hot. Uh, so that's hot grease. So now we're going to grab our bacon like so and place it in. Uh, okay, well, you know, that'll work. And then another one. And we're just going to let that cook for a really, really, really long time. So we're just gonna ignore the bacon cooking in the back. And right now we're gonna cook some chocolate chip Eggo waffles. And yeah, this is part of my breakfast. It's very nutritious. As you can tell, it's pretty crispy on the other side. So we're gonna flip it over. Oh, and not do that. And you see how much grease comes out of like two bacon pieces? It's crazy. So we're gonna flip this one over as well and just 
cook the other side. So while that is cooking, we're going to butter our waffles. So by now our eggs are really cold. So now we're gonna grab our waffles, put them on this plate right here. And butter them. We're gonna grab this butter, apply it like so. They're already cold, so they're not gonna melt on the waffles. So I'm just gonna put them in the microwave for like 15 seconds. Now our bacon is done, as you can tell, because it's really, really burnt. I like my bacon burnt to the point where there's probably no nutrients I'm gonna get out of it. So I think this is finished, and I'm just going to place it on this napkin to drain out all of the oil. So the butter has melted onto the waffles and the eggs have gotten reheated. So now I'm just gonna put it all together. This is the final product. And now I'm gonna serve some cranberry juice and this will be my breakfast. It's currently 1 p.m. So I'm going to eat this breakfast and then I will see you guys real soon. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you liked it, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, please subscribe if you like these types of videos. This is actually part of a week-long vlog I did, so if you enjoyed that, please make sure to subscribe so you can get a notification when the next vlog comes. Also, make sure to hit that notification bell button because then you'll know when I post. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you all in a few days or next Sunday. Either one. Okay, bye.